Hello. Good morning to you. I am uh, Stasia. Uh, you reached a bolo up. And what you see before you is my comic. It's not my comic. I mean, I bought it, but I didn't create it. By Doctor Strange, Sorcerer Supreme. By Marvel Midnight Suns. Is there a doctor in the house? It's a direct edition. And I'm just kind of going back to basics. So let's do this. Let's open this up and see what it says. I'm just going to set my phone here so I can have hands free. Ooh, sticky. That's a sticky. I just woke up. brush my teeth, getting ready to go for my morning walk, and then I got a lot of errands to run today. All right, so look at that glint in his eye. <laughs> so let's see what it says here. Publication, volume number one, number 63. Manhattan after dark. Even the most jaded members of Fifth Avenue New Society had their sense of wonder abruptly sharpened when the gleaming shrine of modern man's ambition cut into their skyline, seemingly overnight. Now, however, this buzzing hive of international business by day glows with revelry by night. The place to see and be seen is the tempo. Stanley, a song of blood opal. So usually I don't like to just get into the first part of it. Uh, I'd like to save that for you, but I will for this video. To the host who makes every evening more gras. A toast to the good doctor. The doctor! Shh, my dear friends. Not the doctor, the magician. May this wine kiss your tongues. May it sting with pleasure for it hungers to be tasted. You're funny, you know that? Doc, uh, <laughs> funny but like strange. Please, Kara, call me Vincent. Came out of nowhere. Now he's a top psychiatric consult. Big city contacts. Real estate international communications. He's made an assertive rise. I'll tell you that. Assertive. I hear there are blood stains in every office building downtown. My gentle guests dismember me behind my back under a delusion that I cannot hear. For a time, however, you are worth my non-listening. Don't pretend to be on a modest <laughs> to you, Vincent. Not when more provocative positions are. <laughs> can be imagined. Of course, it's just like a guy, isn't it? Enjoying my view? The chill air puts such an edge on the city, doesn't it? Did I tell you I'm very fond of cats? I might add you to my collection. He's a smooth operator. Meow. Steven, I'm embarrassed for you. A child would not be guiled by your in disguise. So did the magician really invite this little stray cat to party with all of these somebodies? Just so he could pet her? Really? 
so cornball-y. Okay. <laughs> and as our host leads his feline companion out into the winter night, an unexpected guest makes his presence known. Cat, let's see. My imitation is in my other tux, buddy. Is there a problem? I'll inform the doctor, mister. Just Blade, he knows me. But if that, but if it's true what I read, that Doc Strange did justice so he could become a Wall Street big shot, then I'm gonna make sure he wishes he never heard of Blade Vampire Hunter. Blade's always a badass. So, let's see. And you got the people mingling and tingling. Where is he? Wait, that's moderate. What's that land tricks there, done? He's gone. Hey, if you want to mosh, I suggest you go downtown. Okay. Just not feeling that one. Wait a sec. I knew I recognized you. You talk at New York University years ago, right? I'm really into, like, antiques and myths and stuff. Why'd you get the blue contact lenses, huh? You mean like this? You had the sexiest gray eyes with little flakes. Oh yeah. So easily persuaded I must make her mine, at least for a few hours. Listen, I'm not so comfortable with, uh, there's something here. I mean, let's, let's like introduce ourselves the right way without the mask and all the glitter. Another night. Okay, I'll call you. <sighs> so hot. Tearing at her clothes, yes, card not, and quite suddenly we feel we feel like dancing. We feel like dancing. Go, girl! Somebody stop her. She whisk out her her swords. Ah! Ah! Oh, all right, Doc. You were supposed to be the Midnight Sun's occult advisor, or have you freaked out on us again, my friend? I feel I should know you, although somehow I don't. I do know that you are impertinent. I mean, my invitations clearly denoted carnival attire. I was just gonna help this lady. I think that's what I came here for. Uh, yes, it was my friend. And all you remember of tonight is that which you fear the most. Ah, the Mercedes is waiting, sir. Dear cat, the night closes in and we have so much to see and so much to learn and so much to feel. Because his mother succumbed to the bite of vampire Deacon Frost while Blade was still in her womb, there are moments when the vampire hunter recognizes, and he wages a war loss before he ever drew breath. And thanks to pervasive Doctor Strange, this is one of those moments. Get, get, get back! No, 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 no. Security will see that nut to the street where he belongs. Here I am. Too much of Vincent's special party punch. Party crashers, such a drag. New York, why am I here? So this is nine minutes of me reading into this comic. I don't know if I'll finish the rest of it on my next one. Uh, it looks interesting. It looks like it's getting better. Um, so maybe I'll save this until next time. Uh, today 
is quite beautiful. I'm no longer in California, I'm back in Arizona. Um, it remains to be seen if I'm gonna be here, stay here. Um, I'm looking for a job because currently I'm out of my jobs. So I got laundry to do. And these are the things on my priority list. <laughs> and to clean out my closets and my apartment that I um, have come back to. So if you want, drop a comment. Let me know how you're doing. Let me know if you want me to continue this. If so, uh, then I will come back on Sunday of next week and read this. Um, my book for We Read Wednesday, um, when I was traveling in California, I had to leave it um, in a bathroom. I had to leave it behind because it was too heavy um, with all my belongings that I was carrying in my suitcase. So I'll have to get another one to start We Read, we Read Wednesday back up again. Um, yeah, so that's all I got for right now. Uh, thanks again for tuning in to Bolo Up, and I hope you have a fantastic day. Let's see. I'm going to jump ahead too much. Okay, yeah, I'll save this for another one. Where? Where are we? Technically, my goal, we adhere parallel to time and space, a normal space of my creation. Though, as such, a sudden guest, you may be more comfortable to imagine my new sanctum, St. Timorium, exists at the locus of access under Trinity Church. Here, the drum of Wall Street's night shift a quarter mile above, but Dr. Strange has little time to squander. Explain, please, why haven't you my former Bleecker Street address every night? I don't, I don't get it, okay? I, will, I believe you have some bloody gold hanging there upside down. It is you who are upside down over it. But I understand. What? Everything has been unable. Allow me to set you straight. This concludes my session. Have a great day. Bye.